Hey. So, today is my interview with Sherelle J. Hello, everybody. Y'all come on in here. Let's get ready for this interview. It's just sticking all up. At least y'all know I got some. They all out from under the scarf. Trying to hide the edges. It's time for these braids to come down. But in about a good six minutes, we're going to get started with this interview. Pray to God to go good because my husband is not here. And I got the babies, y'all. Like, I got the little babies. I don't have my big kids. I got the babies. I've literally given them a go get an orange and a Twizzler and the notes that holds them off. And I know that's like the worst thing I could. There probably ain't even no good combination, y'all. But the interview starts at 5 and it's 4.56. We've already confirmed, you know, everything. So <sighs> this is a dope interview for me. So excuse me if your girl look a little nervous because I am very nervous at the moment. My edge is sticking out on each side. Jeez. So, breathe. Hey, see, uh, hey, Bert. He's watching. Now I'm even more nervous because he's watching. You missed the part when I said that I gave the girls a snack to hold them over, and they're literally eating gogurts, a Twizzler, and oranges, and some water. I think that's all a very good combination. Let me see. So it's four. It's four fifty-seven. Thank you. You should have seen me before. Well, you did. Uh, it's four fifty-seven. Um, so she should be here shortly. Um, <laughs> um I gave them one Twizzler a piece. I gave them the Twizzlers in the kitchen. You know the big ones. They belong to you. Yeah, those Twizzlers. Yeah, I gave them those. <sighs> Let me shake my arms loose. <sighs> do, 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 do. Like my hands sweating and stuff. Okay. Oh, thank you. <laughs> she thinks we're adorable. You should... You should see us off the camera. <laughs> Y'all, I'm like, my hands are sweating. Like, I've never been this nervous to interview nobody. And I don't know why I'm nervous at all. But I am nervous. But when it's over, I'm going to be like, yeah, boy, I did that. Sup, NY32211. Look, you gonna have to come on here tomorrow. I'm from Louisiana. You gonna have to come on here tomorrow for the tea spillage, okay? Okay. Huh? No, just hold it in there. Y'all see how I'm already doing it? Oh, husband, come home. Like, speed. I'll pay that ticket. No, I won't. Don't speed. Just come home. Like, they're like, Mom, can I throw something away? And they're four and three. Like, uh, finally, Shreya J. Uh, what time is it? Yeah, in like two minutes. I'm all super nervous. Do, do, do. You know, have y'all ever just sat down and looked at y'all and be like, dang, I look like my mama or dang, I look like my daddy? What? What? Yeah, but stop calling my name. Y'all, my kids ain't gonna let me be great. <laughs> they gonna be all done. Y'all hear them? Oh my God. Yeah, I just be sitting there looking like, no! Kari, yeah. no screaming, because what am I doing? Uh, 
Okay, when she come back in there, y'all got to close the door, okay? Okay. Thank you. Okay, baby. Oh, uh, yeah, you would just sit there and be like, dang, I look like my mama. Dang, I look like my daddy. Hey, 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 go in the room. Y'all, I'm going to be so embarrassed because I just know my babies. I know my children, y'all. They just... They gonna come here eventually. Y'all hear them? Do y'all hear them? Can you hurry up? Yeah. You done? Uh -huh. you, you Google? Noah. Huh? Shh. Y'all. What time is it? It's five o'clock. And you know how kids like that little don't have any like sense of privacy she like asking her what she doing you can hear you hear them <sighs> hold on y'all i'll be right back okay i'm back i'm back Okay. Y'all hear that? <laughs> uh, they closed the door. Okay. <sighs> Y'all. I know that they're going to embarrass me. I'm telling y'all. They're going to be like, Mama, can I go pee? <clears throat> I just know it. Shirt is looking like it's too small. It's not, y'all. It's just the way I'm sitting. Hopefully, they share with their toys. Cause they don't like to share toys either. And they like to do this thing where they scream and get mad at everybody. <sighs> what time is it? Okay. 502. Maro, can you go see if she's live on hers and then come back and let me know? Nope. She's not. Okay. <laughs> yes. My kids do like the craziest stuff. Like, mama, such and such went to the party and did number this. But they don't say the number. They just say like the actual word. I was saying, go see if Sharia was live on hers. And then come back and tell me. Hey, Miss Verna. Ugh. My throat be wanting to hurt. He not here. He uh he almost here, Miss Verna. He not here yet, though. I'm at home alone with the babies, trying to do an interview. Thanks, babe. Whew. Y'all ever been like... I hear them throwing Legos in the other room. Like, they just throwing Legos. Y'all have kids? A lot of people I ask do they have kids. Okay, no game today. Maybe today when I have Miss Verna, it's so much you with you. Every time you get on live, I get the yarning. Like, I'm tired. Like I'm like I'm tired. We've had literally the longest day today. I have looked like garbage all day today. Hey, you will see me one eight eight. Hey, she's here, you guys. Yeah, them Legos. They have Legos everywhere. One and done. Okay. So, we're going to go live when she requests to join in. Yeah, they be playing with them, them Legos. We have so many Legos. I'm thinking about, like, putting them in a bag and tying them up and throwing them away. And they've started. Let's see. Yes. So I'm calling her. And we're Hi. What's good? How, How you doing? doing? I'm good. I'm How good. are you? I'm good. I, I, can, I complain, honey. I know you be super, super busy. I'm so <laughs> glad I finally got you here now. Me too. Me too. I said it was so crazy because I was a... Uh, on my way into the office, I said, you know what, let me stop. I'm just going to stop right here and chop it up. 
before I go in. I won't even keep you long. I won't I even keep it. you long. <laughs> so, everybody, this is Sheree J. For everybody who don't, who doesn't know you, can you go ahead and let them know who you are? Yeah, Sheree J. In the building, leader of the movement, <laughs> the Be Authentic, Never Jeopardize Your Individuality movement. But I'm an artist <laughs> and a creative and a choreographer and a bunch of things. I love that. So a lot of us, especially me, know you from the four. My husband is a big music fan. So he was like, girl, let's watch the four. And I'm like, eh, I ain't trying to watch no four. And then I heard, go, Raya, go. I was like, okay, we finna watch the four. We just started from season one and like the four is over. I'm like, we just need to hurry up and get to this part. I know and so great. I enjoy everything about Sharia J. I've been watching you and seeing you. And you are amazing, a beast. That, that's what I, somebody in the comments is like, she a beast. Yes, she is. <laughs> so one of the questions that a lot of my fans have been asking me, and I don't know because I don't talk to you personally every day, <laughs> right. is how are you doing health-wise? Yeah, I'm doing so good, man. The creator is so good, so good. I cannot um, be more grateful um, just for how far I've come. Uh -huh. um, you know, like with a disease, um, a disease like that, you do mm -hmm. have to just, you know, consistently forever just make sure you're on top of, you know, your health and listening to your body, but um, I'm doing good, you know what I mean? I'm cancer-free right now, honey. Yes. And so, you know, I'm just living every moment to the fullest. That's all. I love it. Yeah. So, as far as Sharia J, will you ever have a clothing line coming out? Your clothing is so <laughs> unique and so yeah. different. I'm trying to be like you, so... <laughs> Are you going to have anything like that? Oh, you already know. Like, fashion, oh, since I was a kid, has been just, you know what I mean, into my, in my lifestyle. Like, yes. I hip-hop and the hip-hop culture, you know, that's part of the culture. You know, yeah, okay. And, uh, fashion and style and, and all that. And I was really heavy in that scene when I was a kid. So, um, yeah, you already know. I done worked with, collaborated with a bunch of different designers. All right. Things, just because it's my, you know, it's my life. It's just who I am, too. But um, we definitely setting up now some a couple of brands um, I'm working with right now. Somewhere. I can't wait. Look, I'm trying to be on all yeah. my Banji gear yeah, and say everything. That. Everything. <laughs> what does Banji sure. mean? Banji is an acronym for Be Authentic, uh -huh. Never Jeopardize Individuality. I love that. I'm teaching, I have a 10-year-old daughter, and I'm teaching her because we live in a, it's like an all-white neighborhood type thing. And I'm teaching her. Girl, girls around the world, like your mama, trying to cut her hair off to get it back to what you have right now. <laughs> right. And I'm teaching her being you is like one of the most beautiful things you could ever do. Yeah. And she has like this Afro texture type hair. And, you know, she got to school with the little kids and they have long hair. And I'm like, listen, honey, the best thing you can do is have shrinkage and pull up on these girls with a little straightness. <laughs> and they'd be like, where did that come from? Like, that would be well, amazing. That's good. That's awesome. That's good to instill that, you know, that kind of mindset in her at a very young age. You know yes. I, mean? I had some great women do that for me, and I think that that definitely shaped the woman I became and, you know yes. what I mean? and still, is, still is. I love it. How did you feel being on the BET side? That is something I watched because I was anxious ah. about that, too. <laughs> How <laughs> right. was that for you? That was dope. That was a dope experience. You know what I'm saying? I was very grateful to be up there with some other, you know, all females and uh -huh. some queens. And we were the only females this seed this year. Yes. Um, but at each one of us stood for something different and uh, positive, which you already know I'm a big advocate for that. And it was just a blessing for me to, you know, get up there and be acknowledged by something like BET. We've been watching that since we was kids. Right. Um, and just get up there and be able to uh, do my art and have something to say to the people. Would you, do you prefer being like an indie artist or would you rather be a label artist? Um, right now, I'm very, I really prefer being an indie artist. Um, right. Because I'm really about my art and my craft. I love to have, you know, creative control over just what I express because you know what I mean? It's really, it's who I am. It's a representation of who I am. And so yeah. I always want that to remain authentic. And, mm -hmm. and, you know, I've been in the industry. I've been, I've had a lot of experience with different labels and all that. I mean, shout uh -huh. out to the labels and to people who are on labels still, you know what I mean? Yes. But, you know, I'm myself uh, starting a new label.
table. And, um, and you know, I think right now the position I'm in is just with the, the, um, the journey that I've been on, for me, being independent right now is a plus. I love it. It's so many people that look up to you. And I'm like reading my questions as I'm looking. So if I lose eye contact, it's just from looking right here. <laughs> nah, it's it's okay. so many people like, if you click the hashtag that just look up to you because you are a really authentic person. You can see that in you. And when you can see that in somebody without even meeting them face to face, that's like an amazing thing. You just know, like you have this spirit that's just like, boom, in your face. It's real. <laughs> it's, like, it's, it's so sweet. And right. even seeing you going through your own thing on the floor and still having this spirit, like it's an amazing thing for people to watch Thank and to you. see because we all out here living normal and we complaining about i don't want to get up and do this the next come day come on you know me, how we do you know how we yes do. meanwhile you over here helped and then you still coming out like i'm about to blow y'all out this is it i'm gonna blow y'all out and you still did your thing and i want to tell you i appreciate it so much like some people don't know when they're in the moment how they're affecting somebody else they're kind of just thinking about what they have going on and watching you do that and knowing because i've had family members go through the situation knowing how hard it is on you without the cameras and with cameras yes. i appreciate that that strongness and being black is a plus being a Come strong on. black woman Come i on, appreciate Valentine. that <laughs> so i know you have to go but one of my last questions um is what are you working on right now if you can tell us oh yeah true um before it was a great um platform for me too you know it really got gave me an opportunity to get exposed to a lot of different people who didn't even know that i was out here rocking you know what i'm saying right so that was um that really opened up a lot of opportunities but i am about to drop a record before the end of the year yes record. yes and it'll be the first record off of my own label banji entertainment yeah um, okay come on banji so you know so you know come on, but i'm very um i'm very excited about it and you know and i'm glad to stand in that position and be you know, some per a person who got it right from the bottom. You know what I'm saying? And my yeah. brand, my brand was a solid brand that was built step by step, piece by piece. And you know, what I'm right. saying? It's still, it's still building that way. Uh -huh. And so, um, yeah, I'm, I just did a, a dope collaboration with Little Mix. Uh huh. Um, I've heard. I've heard. If y'all yeah, haven't, so. make sure y'all go download that. <laughs> Get it all, right. all of that. Okay. <laughs> right. We're doing pretty good. And you know, that was an honor too for me to just be able to rock in. I think on the album, me and just me and uh, Nicki Minaj is the only two female rappers. And so, uh -huh. you know what I mean? That was a blessing. I definitely have respect for her craft and, you know, yeah. what she's done in the hip hop game. And, um, yes, that, I'm also I'm working on some, um, I just got an opportunity to place one of my pilots that I wrote. And uh -huh. so, I'm excited for what 2019 is bringing. Go, Raya, go, Raya, go. <laughs> That I'm part. excited for you. Thank I cannot you. wait. Thank you. Appreciate I love that. it. Thank you very much for doing this interview. I got a baby trying to come out here. I just put the kids in the room. Like, y'all going out for the interview. This is Y'all go away. Right? And they all in the living room. I but love it. Thank you so much for it. Thank you. You can say hi. Say hi. Hey, princess. <laughs> thank you so much Peace for doing this. Thank you for doing this interview with me. No problem. Um, and Thank you for supporting me, you know what I mean? Because I, I appreciate everybody that supports me and just send that love and positivity. You are so way. welcome, always. Anytime we see our black queens doing something, instead of them, like, us pitting them against, like, when one win, we all win, and people don't understand Come that. on, that's they very important. That's when very important wins, for us to lock in. Yes. Yeah. So anytime, I'm always supporting, I'm always in that corner. Whenever something new come out, I got you on the posting edge. So I'll say that. Thank you. Thank you. Just let me know to look. We got the emails. We can link up. I got you. I got yep. you. Thank so you, thank you so much that. for doing this yeah. interview and have a good rest of your day. Thank you, too. Bye, y'all. Bye. Say bye. 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 <laughs>